Hey, welcome to another Bumpai video and today we are going to do another bidding video. And the reason for this is because, well, from Japan sent me an email that they have changed their policy so that the pricing is different. And I did one video earlier, I have to tell you, uh, but of course what happened is that I got admit on this uh, specific auction. So to prevent that from happening again I'm going to take a sniper bit. Um, so the auction that I'm going after, I'm can, going to open it up here first, um, that's basically this item. And this item is a Karina item. And the Karina item is a two-fold brochure. And it says there, yes, we can. Well, for the people who know that phrase, it's uh, it's aged a bit. We now have Trump, who got elected. Uh, but your previous uh, president in the United States said, like, yes, we can. Uh, that's called Obama. Anyway, not mocking him uh, much further. Uh, maybe he borrowed uh, the catchphrase from here. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to bid on it because, well, this auction is something special. Doesn't that look odd? Does does anyone see something that's not entirely correct on this? Mm. Tell me in the comments if you see something that is weird. And then at the end there's more. So here we got some, some special brochure and I want it. And it's costing 800 yen. We have 23 hours to go. Nobody has bid for it. Uh, the seller looks legitimate. And that's it. I'm going to bid for it. And of course by the time you will see this video I probably have won it or have lost the auction. Okay, how much am I going to bid? Well, since last time I kind of blew my sniper bid, I'm going... Uh, yeah, 2000? Isn't that a bit much? Ah oh, well, it, it's going to do that with uh, bid increments of 10 yen. So it's the start price of 800 yen. Bid increment 10 yen. Sure, go ahead. Um, anything else? Is there anything else we can do? No. So we're going to bid. Bid on this item. Um, as you can see, the bidding mode is sniper. My maximum bid is 2000 yen. Um, it's going to charge me 2,000 yen, blah, 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 item URL, blah, 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 and current bid 800, quantity 1. And here we have something that is different. Uh, we can select some sort of plan. So we have a buyer protection plan, 700 yen per order, or a basic forwarding, 300 yen per order. And this basic forwarding isn't much more than, well, we just pay whoever is selling it. We're going to receive it in any condition that it is in and we'll just forward it to you. And if it doesn't arrive, your problem. Um, you can have insured domestic shipping. Um, so here we have a lot of explaining to do, basic forwarding, uh, da, 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 da. no investigations, no refunds, no exchanges, refunds will be provided, blah, blah, blah. So in this case, um, I would say it's not a very good plan. If you want to have a bit more secure plan that you at least receive the item, uh, the, the 700 yen order doesn't sound that bad. It's around seven dollars or six euro for me given the fact that i'm bidding on something that i hope to get for 800 yen because that's the initial price um 700 yen is a bit much uh, yeah and well the the uh, the person i'm bidding to is going to be a reliable person so i'll just go for the basic forwarding plan um i have no clue what the difference is here. So we have domestic shipping. We will select an all an ins insured domestic shipping method with tracking whenever possible. Sure, fine by me. 
Then we have a couple of uh, things that we have to agree upon. We cannot ship items that are prohibited. Well, uh, not in this case. Sniper bit. And there we are. This, this was what I was expecting. So we have now a confirmation that our bit has been submitted successfully. Um, this is different so far. And I'll guide you through all the other differences that I can find. Okay, so we have won the auction. It's uh, it's a miracle we have won it. And yes, we can win auctions. I'm sorry about this pun. Uh, yeah, the, the auction, I'm, I'm still thinking it's an interesting thing. I mean, these are the things you can add to your Karina if, if you're disabled. And it's amazing what you can get as parts. I mean, this, this motorcycle handlebar, it's insane. Just imagine what you can do with that. Anyway, uh, let's head over to uh, this item. What do we have here? It's not, we, we haven't received it yet, so I cannot click anything yet. Oh, product details, let's have a look. Okay, item information, final bidding bid is 800 yen. Uh, bank transfer fee will be 200 yen, will be quoted after charge two payment. Uh, item price, 800 yen. Nothing else, so it doesn't mention here that I, ha I actually have like the handling cost of 300 yen. Uh, domestic delivery charge is uh, 494 yen, will be quoted after the charge 2 payment. So uh, that's like, wow, that's insane. So I'm paying like 700 yen for domestic shipping and bank transfers. So even though uh, it doesn't sound that bad if you are using, let's say, the, uh, the handling fee of uh, 300 yen and saving a bit of money, you still pay 700 yen in transfer fees. So even though it's a cheap item, I'm going to spend almost the same amount for getting it to from Japan. Insane. And we have received our item from, from Japan and well, they have actually so we have our charge one uh and the charge one is basically it's 800 yen that's what i paid for the item um and there's still no charge one so so far everything is the same continue confirm okay now we're going to add some shipping instructions so, anything different here? Up to FJ shipping option, beta. Um, should we do that? Uh, let's confirm that we have the above regulations. Or will we... No, let's, let's see what they tell us. I have confirmed the above. That's it. Okay, so now we have uh, a day later the request to do the charge two payment. So that's like charging for the shipping and for all the other stuff. So let's start doing that. So I still have the quantity uh, that I can put on the, uh, on the recipe. So I'm going to ship it for 100 yen and not 800 yen. Packing status, it's 0 0.14 grams. Shipping methods. Ooh, this looks a bit different than previously. So we have AMS, which is really expensive. We have airmail. Uh, yeah. So if we choose airmail, it may not be shipped out instantly due to the quantity requirements of Japan Post. So they probably send it in large quantities. S-A-L, um, yeah, I don't know why it is this expensive. If I choose service mail, it's, it's going to take a long time. And if I'm going to send it via airmail small packet, it's a lot cheaper than just regular airmail. Why? So... Why? Why would it be? So 
So uh, SAL small packet. That's what I chose the last time, small package SAL, and that seems to be the, the cheapest option, and it's only 280 yen. Sounds like a bargain. Uh, so the charge 2 is the domestic fee is 494 yen. We have the payment fee, which was included because of the, uh, the, 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 the bank transfer that was outside the normal package plan. Then we have the 300 yen insurance plan, which is like basically no insurance at all. Um, Oh, I want it as a gift. Yes, please. Uh, and then we have overseas shipping. So the total charge to next to the 800 yen is 1,274 yen. So the total would be around 2,000 yen. I'm not using points. Uh, pay partially by points. It doesn't state that. Uh, I'm not going to use points anyway. Uh, not going to pay that, I'm going to use the deposit. So I still have enough for the deposit. Proceed to checkout, check if this is check if this is correct. Looks fine to me. Alright. Make payment. Okay, and that's it. Um, this is this is actually what I've done so far. Um, there isn't a whole lot different between what I previously added to the video. Um, the only difference is that you don't pay a fee as a percentage of your bid. Let's put it that way. They just have a flat fee. And for really small items like this, it could be a bit harsh. It's a bit much to, to get such a high fee. Uh, especially if you want to do everything safe and check, then maybe the percentage-wise fee was a lot better. Uh, but for more expensive items, like uh, over uh, $20 or something, the fee isn't that bad. And to be honest, I don't think there is a whole lot different in what I pay for it. And also the, the shipping options, isn't it is not bad at all. So uh, that's it. I'm not going to uh, bother waiting until it finally has arrived here because that's going to take at least another week. I'll put this video out today. Uh, if you have any questions regarding Auctions Yahoo um, buying, um, I'll, I'll do an, uh, another video where I can answer these questions. So just put them in the comment section below. I can answer them. And I'll also make like a condensed version, a TLDR. Um, maybe two minute video on how to buy stuff. Thank you for watching and see you next time.